remembering whether it's remembering the future or whether it's remembering the past or something that you haven't experienced it's all imagination it's all and again imagination in this sense is consciousness or recognizing something that's not of the physical focus that we all call reality it's the same thing it's the same reality but we just call it imagination but again it's the same thing so imagination is simply consciousness becoming aware of something other than here this focus so when you're remembering something that's what you're doing and if you can remember anything like any realization you've had any experience even a drug experience or when you were drunk or when you were a kid or when you were highly alert or whatever it is whenever you remember or recall an experience you've had before you are again re-realizing that experience you are again embodying the frequency of that experience so that's very helpful to remember if you can your joyful states your free states whether as a child or as an adult your excited states your joyful states whatever it is that you wish to experience right now recall an experience where that was already the case and allow imagination to expand to become an actual sense that's inclusive of all senses and so you use imagination you use the heart space in a sense consciousness immediately directly instead of going through the physical senses you're using consciously immediately to tune into a memory or picture that functions as a symbol for an actual frequency of consciousness that you right now feel a strong resonance toward experiencing and so free yourself up become imagination instead of being a physical being that's thinking of something become imagination see that you are consciousness immediately connecting to different parts of its own self through imagination through recognition through focus through consciousness and as you do that you'll see it becomes more and more easy and more immediate to be back in whatever state makes sense for you whether it's a state of just presence or a state of excitement or a state of joy or peace whatever you're here for to realize or whatever in that moment you resonate with realize that you are imagination every single experience is imagined directly within consciousness so use those memories and so it seems to work for you it, it does i i enjoy playing with it um every time anytime i experience some reson more resonance with that excitement with the wonder with the expansive possibility within my own life with my own experience i like it i want to lean into it i want to experience more of that i get excited i want to run into it but the more i see the more i want and i just want to keep going and you know there are different things that i think pull my attention out of that do that i i might not be aware of that are actually limiting me from furthering that experience and i so you're afraid of desire are you afraid uh, of too much passion no, I don't think I'm afraid of it. I just think that Conscious. I want to more efficiently realize it. What is it you want to realize? More of the feeling of awe and uh, excitement and joy and love, I guess. And um, so you want more of that the moment you feel that? Yes, exactly. That's natural. And that's how you absorb. That's how you sink into. That's how you dissolve into becoming imagination, becoming the immediacy of consciousness more and more. So it's only good that you want more. It's natural. Once you taste something good, your whole being is designed to want more of that. So that it is sort of pulled naturally, magnetized into more of that state, frequency, or whatever you want to call it. So that's good. You know that? You realize that? Yeah, yeah. I I, I don't think it's bad. I, okay. I like it. I just, I guess what I'm asking is, I feel like uh, there's there could be ideas mm -hmm. um, in this process of, desiring it and desiring to desire it it may free me free that it, me up that i could apply to that experience that would allow me to experience even more and stay in that experience and, hold, and not hold on to it but just be in that uh more fully more more intense maybe not intense is the word but just more fully and, and have it have the expansion keep expanding and have that expansion keep expanding and it that just will be, happen anyway that's inescapable i don't get any tips Secret, for what? Secret. I don't see the problem. Was... You're doing great. <laughs> <laughs> what do you need tips for? Maybe uh, maybe stop doubting the process. If you do doubt the process, what are you? What is it that you are afraid of, or that you are asking about? Your whole story sounds sound to me. It seems to be working for you. You're, are you becoming more of what you wish to be in the sense of embodiment or realization or freedom? Yeah, totally. I I, I don't think I'm presenting a problem necessarily. Okay. I just 
and for I'm what, excited for, about for it, it and now I'm to... now I'm looking for more ways that I can more efficiently get more excited about it. You know, I like <laughs> you've you've run out of ways. No, but I feel like you could you have some good insight that I that I could glean. That if you, I don't know, maybe not. Maybe this is what's happening right now. You're just telling me to keep going, and that's it. And that's the advice. I'll take that. Do you feel you're stagnating? Mm, no. Seems to be doing great. Okay. All right. Keep doing um, what you're doing. All right. And go to Earth. Sorry. All right. <laughs> is is.